What's up everyone? Today we're going to be going over how to set up goals as your team. So I am signed into my Rainmaker account. We're going to drop the menu down in the top right hand corner and we're going to go down to the team profile. It's very important that you are in the team profile. Now we're going to go to reports, which is the fourth icon from the bottom on the left hand menu. And we're going to select goals in the menu at the top of the page. So now we're going to press the goal settings button here. We're going to get started. We want a total profit of, um, we're going to say $100,000. And then we're just going to leave our expenses where they're at. If you know the information about what your expenses are, um, whether or not the transaction takes place, example, salaries, is lead generation and marketing expenses, education, occupancy, automobile expenses, etc. So if you know your expenses, be sure to type them in here. I will not be adding mine until next year's goals, obviously, because I'll have to close my QuickBooks out in order to truly know what my expenses have been in my first year of real estate. So the cost of sales, same thing here. Um, this needs to Take place example splits to other agents, transaction coordinators. So make sure that you know how much your staff is costing you for each sale. And this is, I mean, this is important to know in the team stuff anyways. So then we're also going to say that we want 50% buyers, 50% sellers. And we don't typically deal with leases here at our market center. So we're going to say average commission per unit. Um, I'm going to say 7,500. Goodness, I added a few extra zeros there. Same thing over here. Um, and that's still a little bit low even for our area, but I wanted to be a little bit more truthful than the $5,000 per closing. Okay, so as we come in here, I'm going to leave all of these settings the way that they are, but command learns your conversion rates as you use it more. So the more thoroughly that you use command to run your business, the more it uses or the more it learns what your true conversion rates really are. So this is based off of my conversion rates as I've been using command for the last year. Um, so it knows exactly how many of those leads I convert into listings or buyers. So I'm going to leave this alone. And that's that. This is our year in review. This is what we want. We want $100,000 annual profit goal. Um, the cost of sales, $7,500. Operating expenses, $7,500. We're going to aim for 50-50 between listings and buyers. And, oh, I've messed this number up. <laughs> so let's go back. Oh, gracious. Let's fix the extra zeros here. There we go. Now this should be dramatically more accurate. 7.50 and 7.50. There we go. So we're going to press what's next. So it wants us to say, hey. Do you want to go into how are we going to achieve those goals is what command is basically asking you now what's next how are we going to get there so you can go to reports you can go to the command home screen or you can go to smart plan kelly guide i'm going to go back to the home screen and this has been a tour of how to set your goals as a team don't forget to be getting your numbers ready so that you can set your 2022 real estate goals and we'd love to help you achieve them so please let me know if you have any questions or if you just want to have a conversation about how you can hit those numbers more accurately have a fantastic day